All right, guys, check it out, man. You hear the music? Just keep on watching. Take a walk with me. Let's go. Oh, backwards. You can do this with a camera. Oh, listen to this. In the living room. Same music, same time. One minute. Let's keep walking. You're going to love this. All right, it's going to get a little dark here. We're going down the... We're going down the staircase. Could we be going all the way to the basement? Oh, we are. Oh, yeah. In the theater room, same music, same time. Today, I'm going to show you how to make whole house audio on a budget. I hope you're ready for this because this is going to be really cool. It wasn't too long ago that whole house audio was only for the rich and famous, but companies like Arillic are changing that stereotype. They are not only making it affordable for you to have whole house audio, but they're doing it by making a more powerful unit as well. Now this is the Arillic A50 and it does absolutely everything you could want a whole house streaming unit to do. Now, those of you who watch my channel might recall a smaller DIY unit that I reviewed that was also made by Arillic. This is compatible with this unit, but this is made more for those of you who want to buy a completed product without doing the DIY work. You could just connect this to your network and download the Muso app. Now I said it does it all and I'm really not kidding. Just take a look at the back of this and you're going to see what I mean. First, you're going to notice two antennas. One of those is for Bluetooth and the other is Wi-Fi. You also have a line in to play a source like a CD player or an NAS or maybe even your television. It even has USB, and for those of you who want to hardwire your internet, it has an ethernet port. Finally, this thing is also an amplifier, so you can easily hook up two speakers, either four or eight ohm, for a max of 50 watts. And it does all that in a very small form factor. It's just a little bit bigger than my Roku 3. Now that is not all it has to offer. You can actually hook up 10 of these Arillic products together to get whole house audio in 10 separate rooms. In fact, today you heard three completely different Arillic units playing the same music simultaneously. You had the A50 hooked up in the living room, the mini Wi-Fi module hooked up in the kitchen, and the DIY amplifier hooked up in the theater room. So three completely different devices without any delay in the signal. And if you wanted to play different music in each room, well, you can easily do that. You just get onto the app and drag and drop to create different zones where you can play different music in each of those zones. Now you can easily just pick one of their streaming services or you can stream from your phone, iTunes, or even a DLNA device. So if you have thousands of songs on your computer that you want to be able to access, well, this can do that. And one of the ways it really separates itself from the competition is offering the ability to stream high resolution audio such as FLAC at 24 bit 192 kilohertz. Not even Sonos offers that. Now that should make some of you audiophiles pretty happy. Now this is not the only way a Relic separates themselves. I mentioned that they are powerful units, and they are. In fact, this unit is like having two separate Sonos units, the Sonos Connect and the Sonos Amp. This can amplify some speakers you have lying around or even in ceiling speakers. Yet, if you already have an amplifier or Bluetooth speaker you enjoy, you just hook up the audio out to those devices and you can stream music that way as well. Typically, systems like the Sonos only offer one or the other, making this a much more versatile unit. So if you get some new speakers, you don't have to worry about getting a new unit. This does come with a remote control, which easily switches between inputs, it changes songs, the volume, and can even equalize your speakers. Now you would expect this thing to cost a fortune with everything it offers. It doesn't, it only costs $169. Now if you wanted to get the similar functionality with a competitor such as Sonos, you'd have to buy a Sonos Connect and a Sonos amplifier, which would cost you $950. Now, I love Arillic is not only making this easy, but it's creating a much more affordable solution for you. Now, if you think $169 is too much, you can easily get the DIY amplifier kit for $69. It's the exact same unit. It does have a couple differences, such as it doesn't come with a case and the antennas are internal instead of external, although you can easily upgrade the antennas and I'll put a link in the description for you. All you have to do is build a really cool box for it and you can save yourself about $100. So is there anything that I don't like about the unit? You know, there are a few things that I think could be improved upon. There are no buttons on the unit, so do not lose your remote control. Without it, you can't change the input, you can't change the EQ or even turn it on or off. However, you can still change the volume inside the app. 
Second, there is no LED screen. Now, I'd prefer an LED screen with adjustable brightness. That way, I could tell what volume level I was on, I could see uh, whether I'd EQ'd it, and of course, what input I'm on. But although a Relic didn't put an LED screen on there, they did implement an LED color system that indicates the input you are on, which is nice. But finally, I would have liked to see a better implementation to hook up the speaker wire. They use screw terminals, which does save space, and they do include a mini screwdriver to install the speaker wire. But I personally would rather have binding posts. And when I make a separate enclosure for the DIY board, you bet I'm gonna include binding posts. However, I do understand why they did that. It does save a lot of space, and adding binding posts would make it bigger. Now, if any of you have considered buying a whole house audio system and have waited, I would encourage you to try this. This really does have me excited about the future of whole house audio. And honestly, I just don't know anything else that I need out of a unit. So I'm going to actually be using these in my house. Now, if you've enjoyed this video and you want to see more videos like it, make sure to subscribe to the channel and ring that bell for instant notification. And if you like to talk about audio gear with other like-minded folks, check out our new forum. We would love to have you. Now this is 123Toid and I'm out, you know. I was once going to be a Harlem Globetrotter. It's a true, true story. Uh, they just didn't want me. <laughs>